yes you're welcome to my channel once again it's your boy jacob bringing you another tutorial about career guidance uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that like button if you're a fan of my content you enjoy uh, my content just subscribe to the channel uh, click the like button it helps this tutorial to be promoted to other people like you who like this content so basically today we are going to talk about a career of a physiotherapist versus a career of a radiographer so both of these professions are quite very good professions if you choose to take any of them i have no problem uh, they are very good professions both at diploma and at degree level uh, radiography is very good at diploma and degree level the same thing with physiotherapy is very good at both uh, diploma and the degree level so the requirements are almost similar to all other science courses um, if you are to qualify for a diploma in radiography or medical imaging they would like you to have one principal pass minimum most uni uh, universities some would insist on two principal passes but one principal pass in either chemistry and biology you are good to go and also if you have like a certificate in nursing and those medical certificate uh, if you want a diploma in medical imaging or radiography uh, they'll give it to you the same thing with physiotherapy uh, so the most popular schools for radiography are uh, Macare and Ecure currently is taking in a lot of radiographers at both a uh, degree and uh, diploma level but Ecure is quite very expensive uh, on a private section if you have to go there for that course you really need to have enough money uh, most uh, degree uh, diploma programs for radiography are um, three years and some uh, degree programs as well are uh, uh, three to four years depending on the university the same thing with physiotherapy uh, programs are uh, uh, three years uh, at paramedical the same thing at a degree level uh, so for physiotherapy if you want it uh, the most popular school is paramedical for a diploma and Makerere for a degree but there are also other schools I think even in Barara is taking up people who are doing physiotherapy but the most important thing uh, let's look at the job market of both a physiotherapist and a radiographer now when it comes to job market uh, radiographers have more jobs than physiotherapists because of what they can do uh, if you have a bachelor's degree or a diploma in medical imaging there are things you are supposed to be good at you're supposed to be good at x-ray uh, you're supposed to be good at taking mri you're supposed to be good at the cat scan and also ultrasound scan so a, a degree or a diploma in radiography it gives you that wide sort of knowledge and you're supposed to be able to take up uh, all those procedures when you have that degree and that's why they are more mar marketable on most institutions they have jobs both in private and public facilities uh, the advantage with it in that you can also set up if you have your money you can set up your private uh, medical imaging center and that is quite very good if you have your money it's not cheap it's quite very expensive so there is a lot you can do with a, a degree or a diploma in radiography and also if you have a diploma in your radiography you can extend and do a degree and they also have a number of master's program so if you take up this profession it's really very good and very marketable and a very rewarding profession if you are a student out there and you want to be a radiographer i would encourage you to take it up because the career is rewarding and the jobs are quite very many now let's look at uh, physiotherapy uh, physiotherapy is also not very bad it's good but the problem with physiotherapy the jobs are quite few compared to those of radiographer because uh, one facility or one hospital will need only one physiotherapist and that's the problem uh, what, what about the rest of the physiotherapists where are they going to work so that's the problem with physiotherapy in that facilities cannot take up many because one person can do the whole job you need at the whole hospital most facilities will take up one or two 
or, or two people and uh, those are enough just imagine with all these uh, hospitals uh, in, in the place and they are taking up only one or two physiotherapists where are the rest going to work so that's the little bit of a challenge with physiotherapy but also there are not so many um students taking up physiotherapy there are quite very few people who are interested in physiotherapy so the the fact that their market is low but also the number of people taking up physiotherapy are few so uh, all those physiotherapists who don't have jobs i would encourage you to take up uh, an international market there are so many recruiting agencies who want to take up physiotherapists to come and work in the u.s to come and work in the uk so a physiotherapist who wants to work in outside the country the, for example in the u.s here and you're a physiotherapy out there and you have your bachelor's degree there are many agencies which take up physiotherapists on an h1b visa you need to have your bachelor's degree and you go through the recruitment process and they'll bring you up in the u.s to work as a physiotherapist so one of the agencies i know which bring up physiotherapists to work in the u.s is a medipro international so you can try them out see their requirements what they need you to have so that you can come and work in the u.s as a physiotherapy that's also another thing if you're a physiotherapist out there and you don't have a job you can try out the international market and you come and work in another country as a physiotherapist so both radiography and physiotherapy are both good professions so if you have a passion for radiography you have a passion to do CAT scan x-rays ultrasound mri you can take up physiotherapy but if you are this person who wants to do with patients physical activities of daily living trying to bring them back to their normal activity exercising them knowing all the routines they need to bring them to their normal activities of daily living you can take up physiotherapy therapy so both professions are a little bit both professions are good uh just a little thing with uh physiotherapy the demand is not so much as radiography that's the only thing but if you want to take up any of the professions i would encourage you to take up because both of them are quite very rewarding